Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at the Botany Manor demo. Let's get into it. 1890, Botany Manor, Somerset. But this game reminded me of The Witness in terms of its look and everything. But yeah, I don't know much about it, so let's get into it. Collect the parcel. What is in it? Abigail Green. Forgotten flora. A herb herbarium? Yeah, Annabelle. Thank you for once again for submitting your book proposed Forgotten Flora. Please send this empty her herbarium back to us once you have completed your research and we'll be in touch with a potential offer. Okay. Research. Maps. But nothing in it. Ground floor, floor, floor. Yes, we just got nothing in it. We're happy to have you back at Otney Manor. I hope you had a lovely trip. In your absence, I'm afraid some things at the manor have deteriorated, though I can assure you we tried our best to keep things in order. I hope it doesn't affect your research too much. Okay, let's see what they've got. A fresh start. Okay, it seems like we're in some kind of very smoky, smoky room. Be steamy? Some set falls victim to industrial smog. I can barely see. It's cut from marine. Okay. On my hike, I came across a windmill wart, a flower that only grows in Sicily. Some locals told me that the flower has air purifying qualities, but due to the bespoke temperature requirements, the plant rarely blooms. Maybe the flower could help with the smog pollution in your conservatory. Okay. So we're looking at a windmill wart. Clues. Important clues get added to the herbarium when you get assigned them where well, you can assign them to plants. If you start tracking clues can help you organize and validate your research. I'll grow I haven't found add a clue. Postcard. So we obviously need a certain temperature for this. Modern instructions. Place pot. Add soil, plant seed, water seed. Uh, we have the seed. But it needs to be a certain temperature. On. How do we access our seed inventory? It's an empty pot. To add soil? Ah, yes, we add soil first. Okay. Got our little windmill wart. What wart? But it needs to be a certain temperature. But let's just put that down there. Okay. Ideal soil temperatures for Mediterranean wildlife flowers. Okay. Coastal, potentially? Um, Sicily. There we go. Coastal flowers. So we're looking at 30. Because the postcard was a picture of coastal city. The 30 degrees. Is, is that what we're looking at? Can we look at these? Down to 30. That's the wrong way. Yeah, see that looks like a coastal. Did he? Uh, 
Ah, we gotta put it there. This is kind of like a point and click game. Oh. Walking sim, if you will. We're looking for, we need another thing. Oh my god, so... A wind it's a volcanic flower. Right, okay. See, we just had to look at the, the poster. Which means Sicily, volcanic flower, 60 degrees. That's extremely hot flower. There we go. And it's cleaning up the, the fog. Okay, so that's basically how this game goes. Kind of a puzzle, relaxing walking sim. That we can put that there. Bam. Done. Very nice. Got that, that worked like a treat. And see where we're going. What's this over here? Rocks? No. Sit down and admire. Beautiful, beautiful art style that this game has chosen. Growing from nature. Growing from nature. Okay, nothing there. As you can see, this is how the kind of no outline textures look very much like the witness and it's overall like colorful and pretty okay, so we do have a little sprint Botany Manor, home of the Green family. Currently busy reserving, uh, researching. Please leave deliveries at the gatehouse and ring the bell. Ding dong. Our entrance card and key. Cool. So when we hear the bell, we'll come back there and collect whatever, whatever it is that we have been delivered. Can't get into the orchard yet. It's okay. So we have another, I guess this is kind of our area that we can customize with different flowers and whatnot. I hope this letter finds you well as you set off for London on your important trip. The thought of you in the bustling city working on your ambitions both excites and worries me. Time has indeed passed and yet your determination for your field remains inspiring to me. I never imagined all of these years ago that we would be writing to each other with our fifth decade about such endeavors. I look forward to hearing about your progress and of course let me know how I can give assistance upon your return. Of in sister Elizabeth. So are we like 50 years old? White duck? That looks like a goose to me. Oh wow. Something happened to that tree. Great Western Railroad, London Plantation, Paddington, sorry. She have returned first class. So, got to do some
Fugalera? Fulex? Fugares? Um, I was caught in a terrible thunderstorm. I'm interested to learn more about his growth requirements. Okay. Blurry photograph. Camera experiment one. Purchase from a new camera, the flash lamp to, and flash lamp to document. My flowers, the pictures look a little blurry though. I'll have to investigate the camera setting. Maybe there's some... Picture is so dark and possible to see the flower. I can't believe how quickly I've run out of that incredibly expensive flash powder. Oh, it looks like it's like bioluminescent. Very pleased with the picture. It looks like I'm getting the hang of the camera. Yeah, interesting. Wonder if that's a clue. Okay, so we got a lot of a lot of um, elements here. I'm gonna mix something up. The art of painting, oil and fresco. Oh my god, that's a lot of stuff here. A lot of plates as well. Some um, ancient uh, Celtic tribes practiced a coming of age ritual. This meant that someone was considered old enough, it was time to prove themselves worthy of staying in the tribe. One of those rituals involved picking a flower in the woods, though not just any flower, of course. The gatherer had to find a fugula, whatever. For this flower to known to bloom only during thunderstorms. Keeping a cool head while lightning flashes were striking left and right of you were considered the ultimate test of courage. Okay, so. Looks like we have to take a picture of the flower for it to bloom. That's kind of how we're getting out here. It's us. Very nice. Flash powder. Uh, highly combustible. Bottle contains 54 grams of flash powder. Chemical co uh, composition, potassium and magnesium. Two to one ratio. Okay, so... Divide this by three, then we get it. Last weeks, I have been seeing a lot of bright flashes coming from the back room of your house. It scares my cows immensely as they think a storm might be coming. The milk production has taken a hit from this, and if you enjoy fresh milk in your morning cup of tea, I would advise you to minimize the flashes. Your, f your friend, Farmer Charles. Well, I mean, you could just, just kind of get some curtains. Of spectacles. Uh, Lumen photography flash now. Fill the container with flash powder, close the container, press the button, and there's a bright flash. Okay. There's two to one magnesium and potassium, right? Is that what we were talking about? Potassium and again. Potassium and magnesium. So, get some potassium in here. One. Magnesium, we don't have any magnesium. Of course, couldn't be so simple, put it. Please to let you know that your family tree is complete. Careful tracing your history, carefully tracing your history of your lineage. As per your request, I have altered the customary presentation now displaying the maiden names of the ladies in your family rather than their current names acquired through marriage. Should you require any further adjustments or additional inquiries, I remain at your service. So, photographers, folklore book, flash hub, bottle, flash lamp. Might be some more stuff for it. Need a key for that kitchen. So we're, we were in the right area. Can we go upstairs or does that require a key as well? As a locked door. See, we can't get in there because, because of the tree. Okay, yeah, let's, um,
Gotta make another one out here. Oil. This. Water it. Pick it up. Take it with me. Put it over here. I feel like we have to learn how to make obstacle. That looks like a piano to me. To learn how to make magnesium or we'll find magnesium somewhere. Oh wait, no, it's here. <laughs> okay, inspect flask. Guess I just completely missed it. That in there? Close that. What else do we have to do? Oh. Press the button connected to the camera and the lumen flash lamp. Witness a bright highlight. Very nice. That's some cool lightning flower. Now, uh, a flash of bright light provide bright light for the flower to bloom. Because of its dangerous growing condition, not many people have witnessed its beauty. There we go. All done. We got a delivery. Break around. I like the music as well. Very nice. It's a very nice atmosphere with this game. I wish it was a bit longer. I was actually having quite a long, uh, quite a fun time with that game. But thank you guys for watching. That was Botany Manor coming April 9th, 2024. That's the planned release date. And hopefully it comes out at that time because I'm really looking forward to playing this. It scratches that itch of the point and click puzzle games, but also the kind of relaxing walking sim that I really like. So thank you very much. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.